I am filming this on my new Samsung phone that I got in a, as part of a program that I am a mentor in that I am excited to tell you about, but I don't know if it is, if that news is public yet, but I have just come off of, what is it like seven and a half hours of calls today? It's April 4th and my first call was at 6.30 for like an advertising award. And then the second call was at eight around disability representation. Then the 945 had a call about being a content creator and then a speaking catch up call that ended at two. So I'm kind of like winding down the day. I'm gonna like decompress a little bit and then yeah, I think I'm just going to decompress it. So let me tell you about the last couple of days. So yesterday I decided to head to Blackbird to just get some work done. I didn't get as much work done as I would like. So right now we're kind of in like the copy editing stage of the book. And I've got like a little bit to do that, but I'm going to be, I'm going to be out for most of next week. So I'm trying to just get ahead of it, had a couple of calls, did a podcast recording, and then a conversation around the growth plan that I have been working toward through this small business program. Tuesday had a couple of calls and then decided to head out to Minotti's to go try this shokupan bread because I got a DM from them saying to come out and try it sometime. And that was a nice like midday break and also just to get some caffeine. Today I haven't had any caffeine and I'm actually trying to weave off of caffeine. Like I only drink caffeine if I'm like going to a co-working space or I'm going to a cafe. And then Monday, Monday I had a doctor's appointment. So that was, that actually felt like most of the day. And then I went to the grocery store Sunday, I caught up with a friend that I hadn't seen in maybe two years. We had both met each other through a podcast boot camp, and so it was good to see her. And then I think I spent most of that day just like catching up on a bunch of work. And I finally feel like I got my inbox under control just after everything that March was. And then Saturday was my last daily update. And essentially, I was headed toward this event called Creating Space. And it was the second installment of, of the event in LA. And this one was hosted at USC and it's just a mental health space for Asian Americans to come together because a lot of us are trying to break intergenerational trauma. Yeah, it's been a pretty packed week. Luckily, I am just gonna try to catch up on things for the rest of today. Then I have my small business course tomorrow and also headed to an event directly, have two events to head to directly after that, but you will hear about it in my next daily update. So I'm gonna test out filming more content on this Samsung phone because it's got five lenses and my current iPhone only has two. The only thing I'm noticing about this new current phone is that it is pretty big. So even just trying to do anything on it, like type, I'm gonna have to figure out like what type of accessibility I'm gonna need for that. I, I got a case for this one, but I might need to get a phone purse for it as well. So I'm excited to have a lot higher quality content. I might start using this device as like my main device to start filming some content if you just wanna see like the difference, but I've always kept things pretty DIY here. Like I never bought any fancy cameras because I feel like I would have to figure out how to navigate those with one hand. And then I do like the idea of getting some more advanced microphones, but the idea, yeah, just like trying to carry them around. I have the one tripod that I use. I have my mini microphone for the anti-ableism series. But overall, uh, I guess I just feel really grateful for the different opportunities that I had, even though it was a lot of meetings. And now I am going to catch up on some work stuff. All right, bye.